Hello and welcome to my daily market analysis videos with me, Richard Perry, market analyst at Hantech on Tuesday the 24th of November. We're going to start with Euro dollar now, but um, I've put a slide together and let's have a look at um, the general risk factors that are driving market moves today. We've got Trump um, who's sort of positioning more um, amenably towards the transition. You've got Joe Biden picking a pretty dovish Jeanette Yellen um, and also more vaccine news as well. So generally speaking, we're seeing markets moving risk positively. We saw that reaction yesterday where we had um, euro dollar moving back higher off a rebound, but it's still the possibility or the prospect of a reversal pattern underway. Um, euro dollar struggling still at this resistance 1890 to 1920. And that really does suggest we still continue to play this range, I think, between 16 big figure to 20 big figure, that 19 figure area, uh, 1880 to 1920, still a big resistance every time it gets towards that sort of level, it rolls over sort of two negative candles in a row now, actually at that resistance on the daily chart. Although you wouldn't argue, you'd argue yesterday's candle is pretty uncertain given the length of the, the tails um, in the shadow, both higher and lower, quite considerably. Um, suggesting that an uncertainty through the market yesterday. A little bit of a tick higher today, but I think that's sort of a bit of a nod towards the positive risk appetite. But generally speaking, euro dollar is still struggling at that resistance and it pretty much every time it sort of moves towards that level, it rolls over. This is the four hour chart. You can see pretty consistently hitting that barrier and falling away. Obviously, it's just recovering somewhat this morning, but again, momentum indicators just sort of struggling to really on the out four hourly. This is momentum struggling to really push on. Let's have a look at the hourly chart. <clears throat> and uh, yeah, a little, little sort of rebound into resistance area. If I get the crosshair, you can see that there's an old pivot actually around this sort of level here of uh, 1850 area, which may be worth having a look at. 1850. But generally speaking, I think it's a really difficult call on euro dollar at the moment because certainly this barrier or the, the, the extent of the barrier, which seems to be something that the market just can't get over through at the moment. So it just means that I'm still essentially with a positive bias within this range, but it just doesn't seem as though the market can get through that barrier to really break through. Now, you've got that support of yesterday's low, which came in at 1790. Um, so uh, that's obviously a, a key low to now keep an eye on. If that gets broken, you, you are then starting to turn corrective. But again, look at that RSI on the daily back below 60. So just struggling really for traction. So with that in mind, I wish you good luck in your trading today. You can click here to subscribe to our analysis videos. Go to our website to sign up for web webinars and also click to watch Trader Talks, our videos that give you top trading ideas.